Hi everyone. I'm going to be setting up for the week of Monday, January the 14th through Sunday, January the 20th in my Coastal Happy Planner, which is my catch-all planner. I'm going to be using the Color Story 2 sticker book and I'm going to be using some things from the Joann's uh, super, I don't know, the mega, mega sticker book. I'm not sure what everybody's calling this, uh, the 100 sticker sheet uh, Joanne book. So I'm gonna be using that and I'm gonna be using these. So far I have three things um, already lined up for this weekend and Brianna is coming down for a visit. So I'm so excited about that. I'm so ready to see her. I miss her so badly. Um, Riverdale comes back on on Wednesday. Yay for that. And then um, we have the music the music walk down downtown. So that's always a fun event. We've actually only ever gone once since we moved down here, but it was a lot of fun. And since Bree will be here and maybe, fingers crossed, she may um, have a guest with her. Be a nice little double date. So we'll see, but let's get started. So I want to mark these things first. And let's see. There are some boxes in this Joann's book that are kind of like the, yes, kind of like the colorful boxes. And there's two sheets of everything, two sheets of the different, the same color. So I'm going to put this right here. don't know what time she's actually coming in like what time her flight lands or anything so I'm gonna have to find all of that out but for now we're just gonna write Brie comes home even though she's not moving down or staying for good she's coming and that's all that matters and Let's see, I uh, like this right here. Um, that go? I love this coastal planner. So the two planners that I wound up with for this year were the coastal planner and the boho dreams and honestly they're just both so perfect i love them both mark riverdale and then we'll mark the music walk for friday And then I think I probably should look up the time and I'll add the time to that. Because uh, I need to find out what time she's coming home as well. Uh, now, let's look right here. 
and see what we're gonna use from the Coastal Planner. Oh, well, the Color Story. It really goes with the Coastal Planner. Let's see. We'll start out with this Seize the Day. Conquer Monday in a big way. I don't really have any specific rhyme or reason for utilizing the rose yet. When I first got my very first happy planner, I did like my work and my home schedule, like my chores, my house cleaning chores on the top row. The middle row I saved for like my homework and class assignments. And then the bottom row, I put in um, like my exercises and workout for the day and tracked my steps. But now that I'm using the Boho Dreams that I'm kind of going through and organizing my homework assignments in that planner and I'm using the Healthy Hero Planner that I'm tracking all of my fitness, I really just don't have any idea yet how I want to break down. So I've just been kind of, it is only like the second week of January. So I'm still trying to tweak exactly what I want to do with these. Let's see. I know I need to get a space to do some, and I may have to go back to those boxes. And maybe I'll use this bottom row for that since I have some various things put in the first, top and second row now. Maybe I'll just do my house chores, my to-do list down here on the bottom. Let me go back into this jumbo book and let's see Maybe I'll just use these little stickers right here. Alternate them. Because my house chores are pretty simple, I, for the most part, keep the exact same routine week after week. It, it works for me. I've tried to change it up a few times, and I just always seem to revert back to what I normally do. And like they say, if it if it's not broke, don't fix it, right? So, 
and I won't use one for Sunday anyway because I don't normally um, I don't normally do any house chores on Sunday that's kind of my free day let's see so we can do something like maybe a little layering Today is your day. There. Okay. So now we'll just look at finding some a little decor. for the weekend think happy be happy of course it's gonna be hard to be happy um, I'm gonna be so excited to have Brianna down and spend some time with her but I think she's leaving I think the 20th the 19th or the 20th and I think it might be the 20th but anyway um, she'll be going back home to Georgia and it's gonna be really hard to be happy when she is leaving me going back up so we'll just have to just have to deal with that I suppose And this right here has this pretty coral shale. And I think I may, there's a coral shale right here. And I may use this over here to tie the two pages in together. That's really nice. this best day ever down on Friday because when we go out a double date with Brianna it's gonna be a great 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 time so I know that's gonna be fun let me look back in this Joanne's box and see what was here I think it was mostly like little stars and corals some little mermaids. That's going to be cute for this summer. Of course, I live in South Florida. Every day is summer now. Every day. Maybe some of this coral right there. Maybe a piece over here to start out Monday.
Okay. And then trying to see if there's really anything else that I want to put on here. I'm not really sure that there is. I just don't want to overdo it. I feel like when I've been doing the Etsy kits, I um, go really crazy and just leave no white space. And I don't really feel like I want to just like crowd the whole page up again because see there's part of an Etsy kit that I did and the whole like everything is you know decorated it's very full so I feel like I just want to leave more white space this time but I was gonna look back here I felt like there was some little more functional. I thought there was like some little let's see. I could have put these upside down. I wonder. How much trouble it would be to change these now. Probably not too much. there and then I'll have some space to put like a little to do sticker up there I should have thought of that in the first place but you know what they say hindsight 2020 and all that good stuff I think I'm tearing this a little hopefully when I lay it back down it won't be noticeable. Hopefully. Ooh, these are hard to peel back up. Or that one was anyway. Oh, yeah, that one is trying to tear a little. I gotta be more careful with them. Uh, now they look like they don't want to lay back down. If they give me too much grief and they keep peeling, I'll just take the second page. Luckily, there was two pages of everything in the Joann's big sticker book. So, if I need to use the strips from the second page to redo this, I will do it. Otherwise, I'm just gonna hope that they stay put because they should stay put and behave. We just have to be really careful. There's such a thin little strip. You don't think about them having that much grip on the paper, but boy. They will tear. And of course this last one wants to be the most troublesome. The little Troublemaker, of course. Whoa, oh, 
I just tore the whole sticker there, didn't I? Okay, I guess I will use this one off the second page. I completely. Okay, so let that be a lesson. These little stickers from the Joann's box um, are very sensitive. So, you probably should want to know where you're going to lay them down in the first place because they don't want to come back up. But it's my fault. I should have I should have flipped them upside down before I laid them down anyway and I didn't do that. So I blame me. Now I'm just going to put these little to-do stickers up at the top. I like these. I like the sticker, but I almost didn't get it. And I, I really just talked myself right out of it until I went to order the Be Happy box. And for that day that they released the Be Happy box, they had the um, coupon code. And I just went ahead and added this to the cart right with it. Let's see. Okay, here's some. Let's see. Monday is trash day. And Wednesday is trash day and Friday is trash day but they don't have the right color and trash day I guess I'll just use this green one Friday trash day. Let's see. A Saturday. Saturday will be grocery shopping day. Okay. I'm just looking at these little, little stickers right here. Little functional ones. Splits. Flags and the little asterisks. Okay. Oh, there was, I forgot there was a second page. I could have used this one instead of that green. I think I will do that. I always forget that there's two pages of everything in this uh, mega Joanne's book. It's maybe this color right here. Yeah. Well, I said I was going to use this one. There. Trash day. So we basically have trash day every day except for Tuesday and Thursday. But go ahead and mark it. And let's see. Maybe. Whoops. Maybe if there's like a quote, some kind of a little quote to put down, that would be nice. Maybe I should just put this relax one down over the weekend. I like that. Maybe I could put it over there. Relax. 
relax. Today is your day. I like that. Okay. And just looking to make sure there's nothing else I want to add to this. about this this is big well maybe maybe not here we go four Brie comes home Okay, yeah, no, I think that's going to be it. So, pretty simple, pretty sweet. Actually, I just thought of something else right here. A little last minute, but these priorities for the week. And, oh, that's a whole sticker, isn't it? I thought it was three little blocks, three separate blocks, but it's not. It's a full sticker. I just tore that whole page off. Okay, and then I'm going to need my habit trackers. For the week. So there will be my three priorities for the week, and then I will add habit trackers. I don't think I have habit trackers in here. So I have to put a, a habit tracker for my vitamins. And I found that I do better keeping the habit trackers for my vitamins in my catch-all planner because I'm in it every day marking like my house chores and everything. Okay, so I think this is going to be it. I believe so. Let me get you back in frame here. Um, I'll figure out my three priorities. I just got to add a little habit tracker for my vitamins. And I'm leaving some white space for whatever comes up. And this is going to be my to-do, some my, my house cleaning chores. And then just important things to remember. And that is going to be it. So thank you very much for watching. Have an amazing day. And don't forget to live your life on purpose. Bye.